kind of um, rootedness would have gone away with all of the growth and change, the diversity and, and the economic opportunity, but we also are a county with virtually no media. I tell people, uh, people in Orange County don't know what they don't know. They, so, so you do not have uh, you know, an LA Times that is telling people in Orange County what's happening in Orange County, with all due respect to the Orange County Register. Um, you, don't have, you don't have television news. And I am the daughter of a television anchorman, so you know, I pay attention to these things. But the truth is that is a huge liability for us because we do not see the face of Orange County on any regular basis. We don't even know our neighbors for the most part. And so the cultural soul of Orange County has been very hard to grow and evolve. The places where we might gather people are very hard to find. You know, um, a lot of people know that UCI was designed, you know, and, and opened in the 60s and designed so that it would be very hard for people to congregate there. Um, Orange County is not that different. Where are the convening spaces where you can go? You know, we, the Orange County Great Park was a, certainly a, that was our aspiration. Um, but things have changed quite a bit there. And that kind of uh, opportunity to create a real heart and soul for Orange County is, is at best not going to be quite what we had hoped for and envisioned. So I think whether it's Christ our Redeemer, whether it's through the Human Relations Commission, whether it's at our religious institutions, our academic institutions, we need to think about how community is built. Because when community is strong, when people feel connected to the places they live, when people know the people they share space with, there are opportunities for engagement, for elevation of thought and, 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 and coming together that are harder to effectuate when those structures don't exist. So I just think that we have to continue to understand the times we live in, the place we live in, the aspirations we have, and then what role we can each play. It's important to be advocates. It's important to fight hate. It's important to fight um, division. But those are soul-sucking, yet important, um, things to do. We have to feed our souls. We have to do the things that make us feel strong and connected and embracing of something positive so that when that negative is there, we're approaching it together, we're addressing it together, and we're, we're supporting each other through it.